The Last Prayer by William Wilfred Campbell Read for LibriVox.org by Marcel D. Ward, the Soul Expands dot com. Master of life, the day is done. My son of life is sinking low. I watch the hours slip one by one, and hark the night wind and the snow. And must thou shut the morning out and dim the eye that love to see? Silence the melody and rout and seal the joys of earth for me? And must thou banish all the hope, the large horizon's eagle swim, the splendor of the far off slope that ran about the world's great rim, that rose with morning's crimson rays and grew to noonday's glory dome, melting to even's purple haze when all the hopes of earth went home? Yea, master of this ruined house. The mortgage closed outruns the lease. Long since is hushed the gay carouse. And now the window lights must cease. The door is all barred, the shutters up, dismantled, empty, wall and floor. And now for one grim eve to sup, with death the bailiff at the door. Yea, I will take the gloomward road, where fast the arctic nights set in to reach the bourne of that abode which thou hast kept for all my kin and all life's splendid joys forego walled in with night and senseless stone if at the last my heart might know through all the dark one joy alone yea thou mayst quench the latest spark of life's weird day's expectancy roll down the thunders of the dark and close the light of life for me. Melt all the splendid blue above, and let these magic wonders die, if thou wilt only leave me love, and love's heart brother memory. Though all the hopes of every race crumbled in one red crucible, and melted mingled into space, yet, master, thou wert merciful. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.